here we go again with more exciting Fallout action. If we were, remember, I'm taking the cohesive 10 man person strong unit into the bowels of the the uh, the subways to get rid of the ant scourge that plagues this poor town of innocent people. Two people. In fact, there's only one kid left in the town, so we're doing it just for him. What nice people we are. I think the uh, cohesive unit is going to meet a bitter end here, though. These ants are tough in these enclosed environments. I don't think the unit's going to make it. If I've gone Skyrim at the minute, I'm uh, doing the Throthcare play Skyrim thing. And I've got a 30 man follower mod on. And it's fucking up the game. Certain quests just won't progress. The NPCs just freeze and don't do anything. I'm guessing it's that mod doing it. But on Fallout, it doesn't fuck up any quests for some reason. You'd think this game would be the one that would be more unstable with mods. Because it's unstable full stop. Went to the uh, cinema last Saturday and watched um, Gravity. First time I've been the cinema since District 9, I think was the last movie I watched. Ocean's 13, around about then sort of time. So this is the first movie in 3D I watched. Because no other movie in 3D looked good to be honest. This is the first one that looked actually interesting. And it was pretty good. It was pretty good. Um, it did lack a plot. It was basically 90 minutes of a big action sequence. Which is a bit weird. I thought it was going to have more story in it. More character stuff. But it was still good because it was visually stunning. Which most films today are not. And um, it was quite tense. And it was, uh, it was even a bit moving. I was moved by some of it. Although the date, the girl I was with, she, uh, she wasn't moved. <laughs> it's almost like guys need action to have a moving experience, and women, these like these crappy love stories, like The Notebook and all that bullshit. I never tell the uh, girls I have a date with what I do on YouTube either. <laughs> I tell them that uh, I do video web stuff for companies in LA. <laughs> That's all they get out of me. So they never really understand it. I go, oh, it's confusing. You wouldn't understand it. Because <laughs> the kind of girls I go out with would probably think this was real stupid. They wouldn't understand this as, a, as a, a way of making money. Oh, Justin! Why? Why? Such a good member of the unit. So brave. And his grave's going to go unmarked. He's going to be in this tunnel. Who's ever going to find him and remember what he did? Get ready for a laser. A TJ laser. Oh, fuck. Gas. Gas and phasers don't mix. Fucking laser in your fucking it. Right in your ass, Jericho, you idiot. What's the matter, huh? I still want to get around to doing Fallout New Vegas too. I gotta uh, I've already bought it ages ago. I've gotta get it modded up. Which takes a while. I haven't got round to it. And I don't know whether to do it as TJ Leather maybe, or Throthgar, or just me again. I always prefer to do it as a character, I suppose, because uh, I wish I'd done that in the first place. Way back when Throthgar was at the peak of popularity. Um, but uh, I didn't cross my mind. Shoot you in the face. <clears throat> 
talking of Throthka, people have been asking me, you know, when's the Throthka follower mod coming out? Well, it's coming soon. I just did the voices finally off my lazy ass. Did all the voices I gave them to the modder, JP Doctor. Who's a great modder, he does loads of stuff for the uh, machinima videos I do. Always helping me out, creating stuff for me and modding stuff. So I gave the voices to him a couple of days ago. I don't know how long it's going to take him. I don't know how complicated it is. But um, he's done it before though, he's created follower mods before I think. So, should be a funny mod. Um, so if you've always wanted to play Skyrim with Throthgar the Dragonborn Hero following you, that dream's gonna become true. I've got one. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, take him out, take them all out. Uh-oh, we've just lost a unit member. Who is it? It's Holly. No. She got too close to the fire. You just stand there like idiots and let yourselves burn. What do you think was going to happen? There's only like two people left. This group of people, of course, were ex-vampire people. And they've slowly been killed off. I'm really looking forward to playing New Vegas again. I haven't played that game in a while. And I'm hoping modded. Modded up, it'll be exciting stuff. Doctor! Startled me. You really mustn't creep up on people like... You're the one creeping up hiding behind a door. Well, yes, I suppose I am. You got a lot to answer but for, it's Doctor. Less goes my name, and it's. Uh... I've chosen this room as a temporary retreat from which to contemplate my. It may be a bit dark. What evil I experiments have you been doing here to these poor ants? Generationally... You're gonna pay for this. Oh my. My problem right now. This whole shit where this guy wants you to keep the Ant Queen alive. When I first played this, I uh, I did that, and he went in there to do his experiments, and the Ant Queen just took his head clean off. So it was like, see, you weren't really buddies with that Ant Queen at all, stupid. Your objective would be to eliminate what I call her quint. No, it should all wrap up rather nicely. I. Once I send this pulse, all of the remaining... So? It's a hefty task, Doctor. Yes, I suppose. I was merely going to... I will also award you with my old lab coat. Let's do it. You... Be careful. Here we go, entering the Ant Queen domain. I got an Xbox One the other day, too. So I'm going to do some bids on that. I uh, wanted to do Dead Rise and ordered that game way before uh, I got the console. And it still isn't here. So I've only got four. So I don't want to do any videos on a driving game. So we just driving aimlessly around the track. It doesn't really seem too exciting. So just waiting for Dead Rising to appear. I've got a fucking In your face, Ant! There's more. There's more of us than you imagine we're going to be here. Surprise! Yeah, run into the fire, you inept idiots. Blow your head clean off. Everybody alive? Just stupid. Mm. 
Move in. There's another one. You have to run in, didn't ya? You've got a machine gun for a reason. You're not using melee weapons. Oh, there's the queen. Get away from that robot, you bitch! I think the, uh, the cohesive unit are gonna take out that bitch. Maybe want to keep her alive and let her take out the uh, doctor. Those five nest guardians are still here, though. There's still another one somewhere. Hey, welcome Where back. is it, Alan? Hey, Where is it? Back. Do you know? Do Maybe you know. When there's plenty of you don't know. As we try and walk past the queen, these guys are going to take her out. Are you Need some help with this one? Oh well, we'll just do it now then. Oh, Brianna right in the fucking head, crippled. Get away from Brianna, you bitch! Oh, she's finished! She fought bra bravely right to the end. Spitting acidic acid. Why weren't there more bosses like this in Fallout, you know? This is what's kind of cool. That's what I like about Dark Souls. You wander around, suddenly some bug fucking monster appears. Why am I getting karma? I don't want to get in camera, I'm evil. There's the other one. Fucking twat. They're burning me! Nice work. We have the pheromones, they're ours. I think there's two more rank queens in this game, isn't there? I'm sorry. Voice signature, not recognized. But there should have been loads more weird bosses and stuff. It would have made exploring. Oh, there's the other one. Fuck me. I thought they were all dead. There's two more left. Guns fucking up. Alan! Right at the last minute, man. We were almost ready to leave. So it took every member of the unit to finally do this quest. Tragic. And not one of them are going to be remembered for it. Not one of them. Nobody, not one of them is going to get a fucking military burial. The situation is unacceptable. Let's go and tell the doctor the bad news. It's science gone mad. Oh, Doctor, your science gone awry, gone baffled. My work is done here. Oh, come now, the fat. I killed that bitch. What? You utter buffoon! I'm afraid I have no further. Your bargain won't be uh, committed to the fullest. Well, then you're gonna get this. Take his head clean off! Jericho, finish what I started! You couldn't be allowed to live, Doctor. You're dangerous. And I'll take that lab coat anyway. We put a stop to the madness. The science gone insane. We can be proud of what we did here today. There's more of these fucking things down here on the way out now. I thought once the queen died, their heads all popped or something. 
Well, they all turned on each other. Turn on each other now! Fucking bastards. Hate these ants. So yeah, though, they're not as annoying as the Cazadors from New Vegas. God, they're fucking irritating. I hope they're not back in Fallout 4. When's Fallout 4 coming out to? What's going on? I'm probably going to end up dedicating this channel to Fallout 4 when it comes out. I'll be the channel on YouTube for Fallout 4. I don't think anyone will love that game as much as me. I want to be able to take that game into new areas like I will with action machinimas. With battle vids the likes of which you've never been seen ever. I'll break new ground on that game that even Todd Howard himself will come out and and be amazed again as he was with my battle vids. <laughs> We've cleansed this town. This town is at peace. We have to find that kid. He's hiding in this shelter, I remember. Um, yeah, we kid. We're here. Hello? It was so weird. All of a sudden, the ants yes. went nuts. Thanks to me. It was like they were totally crazy. I wish I had something to... I guess now you'll be on... I don't know. I guess it's... We can't leave this kid here, fend for himself, Jericho. What kind of scum would we be? Team up with us, kid. It's going to be rough out there. It's going to be hard on you. But with two cohesive unit warriors, you'll be safer than you will alone here. First raider party that comes along, you're going to be cannibalized.